Hello and welcome everyone to some more Baldur's Gate. We're gonna explore this cave, um, but I did heal. Um, I, I can't camp here because it's like in a danger zone as you can see by the red outline. So I had to go outside and camp. And uh, when we did camp, uh, something interesting happened. So take a look. The twilight is darker than expected. Moisture drips down your forehead. Pain shoots through your fingers. Okay, let's see. Rub your aching hands, wipe the sweat. Yeah, let's just wipe the sweat from my brow. Your hands shake as they reach upward. Your forehead remains drenched, no matter how much you wipe. What the heck, Lazel? Come on! Can you feel it crawling through you? Tendrils squirming in your chest, gripping your heart, piercing your belly. Your bones popping, your flesh swelling. I can. I see it in you. I feel it in me. We are lost. I will be quick with my blade. First you, then the others, then myself. Your minds intertwine. You sense a touch of uncertainty, a touch of disgust. We are clearly not lost. I'm in I'm in full faculties of my 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 mind, so is she. Like, come on. I don't want to use that. Persuade. Let's say plus three. Medicine is just plus three. Um, let's try to persuade. <coughs> Mm, excuse me. Just had to sneeze there. So I got a bonus. Okay, let's roll. Come on. Okay, got it. Nice. With the bonuses? Sweet. Bah, I cannot trust my own mind. So it seems I must trust yours. I will wait. But know this, I am watching. If the sickness does not pass come dawn, I will end us all. Okay, well that was weird, Lazel. Jeez, chill the freak out. <laughs> all right, well, let's rest. Oh yeah, I need to get some camp supplies, actually. Okay, I'm I'm getting I need to get a full rest at camp. Um Shadowheart wants to talk to me, so let's not with Lazel. With Tav, let's talk to Shadowheart. In it. It feels like we packed three days into one today. I'm exhausted. Speak for yourself. I'm fine. You sure it's just fatigue, not something else? You as well. I feel like I've marched through across Toral without stopping. Yeah, sure. I'll I'll relate with her. Could be the tadpoles doing. Or not. We'll just have to wait and see. Let's just get some rest. Yes, let's. And it seems like everybody's like even Gale says sickly, Astarian sickly and encumbered. Will is sickly. Lazel seems fine. I wonder why they're sickly. I'm not sure. And even she's she's worn out. I'm like I'll catch a break. Let's uh, maybe that's just part of the storytelling. But okay, See. let's let's get some rest. Chosen, let me come to you. I can help you. Uh, no, I know what you are. You're probably the tadpole wanting me to bow to your. Whims or whatever, I don't know. Uh, yeah, I know your voice. I heard it on the Nautiloid. I've been searching for you. You're always so far away. I like how I'm sleeping in my full armor and everything. <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't trust you. Back off. But I'm already here. You frown in your sleep. There must be so much on your mind. 
her fingers are warm against your cheek, softer than expected. You think that you're sick, that you're dying. Are you afraid? Who are you? Let's see. I know, well, I don't know. I, I have a feeling this is the tadpole in my head trying to get me to lower my defenses. Um, yeah, who are you? You know, I think in your heart, you know, we wouldn't be here like this if it weren't destiny. So you are the tadpole. <laughs> Come now, I'll make you feel better. We're not married, sorry. Go. Lean back. Uh, no, resist. Why are you fighting me? I'm here to help you. The urge for violence lingers. You could push her again. You could cause so much pain. Well, if you want to wait. I'll wait, but I do have a parting gift. And you've gained a new power from your, yep, it was the tadpole. Yep, I figured it. Mm, kind of had a feeling it was the tadpole. Is everybody fine? Yeah, nobody's sickly anymore. Will wants to talk to me, or not Will, Gale. I still hear sneezing, like, like, who's asleep? <laughs> Alright, so what updated? Find a way to remove the Mind Flare Parasite. Last night, we felt early symptoms of seromorphosis. Yeah. Followed by a vivid dream of our greatest desires. By this morning, our symptoms were gone. We really need to get these things out of our heads. Yep, I, I'm... Yeah. I was pretty sure that's what it was. Glad I did not give in. Man, we got a lot to do here. Okay, Gail, uh, how much you want to bet, guys? Place your bets in the comments. The Gail's like, I need something to absorb the energy, blah, blah, blah. Let's see. Something's on my mind. Oh, maybe not. <sighs> good morning. And it truly is, isn't it? A very, very good morning. Do you feel as chipper as I do? Uh, Night brings counsel, or so the saying goes. But last night had quite a bit more in store, wouldn't you agree? I had a feeling he just went... <sighs> How's that for feeling better? What? what was that? I had a feeling he went along with everything in the dream, which... Not very smart, to be honest. So you're not the only one who woke with new felt powers? It's remarkable how much better I feel. There are a lot of questions so early in the morning. Why don't we just skip to the part where you have some breakfast? Yeah, it is remarkable, and uh, I do. I, it's interesting to see that we all have new powers. Hardly. There's a glow about you, no doubt about me too. We feel startlingly well, and yet there's a certain look in your eyes, the far-off distance of a haunting, which begs yet another question: Did you too have such puzzling dreams? Yes, I did. My dreams. Yeah, I'll just nod in silence, because they were... I'm not... yeah. Same here. Perhaps. The jury's still out. What I saw surpassed the vivid. The voice was too true, the touch too tantalizing. I can tell you felt the same. Sought out in the night by... What? An illusion? Or a promise? Um, yeah, <laughs> it felt more like being prey cornered by a predator. Hmm, all too apt an analogy. Let's agree that at the very least, there was the lure of a promise. The touch, the kiss, the everything. Did you relent or resist? Resisted, of course. Then you're stronger than me. It was an expert, this apparition. First the seduction, then the spurning, then that teasing souvenir. You're not ready. I will return when you are. That's what I was promised. We have some restless nights ahead of us. Stop giving in! Okay, you have gained a new power from your Ill 
illithid illithid tadpole. <clears throat> what power did I get? Is it down here? Ooh. Aberrant shape. Let's see. Magically assume the shape of an intellect devourer that can deal psychic damage. Oh, wow. Your new form has 21 hit points, so I can just turn into a, a, uh, an intellect devourer? While in this shape, you can't talk or use spells, cast spells. You take on the attributes of an intellect devourer, excluding your intelligence, wisdom, and charisma scores. When, you, when your aberrant form drops to zero hit points, you revert to your normal form. That does sound pretty cool, but honestly, I feel like the more I use those powers, the worse it gets. Let's see, does everybody have that? I get used to this. Uh, he has something different. Ink blot. Create a cloud of magical darkness and immediately attempt to hide. Creatures within the cloud are heavily obscured and blinded. Creatures cannot make ranged attacks into or out of the darkness. That's pretty cool, and it's a bonus action. I like that. Okay, let's go down the list. Lazelle, what is her move? Blood. She gets psionic pull. Pull one creature or object towards you. Okay. That actually is helpful because she's a melee mm. specialist. What do you got? Healing. Okay, yeah, that works. Infuse a creature with psionic force. If it reaches zero hit points, it regains 3d4 hit points instead of falling unconscious. Okay. How long does that last? Doesn't say. I guess it just lasts forever. But that's pretty cool. All right. Well, yeah, that was a lot to, to happen. So let's head back to kind of where we were and exploring the cave. Yeah. So now that now we're back here, we do have our interesting powers. Step carefully. Okay. Those are traps. Peculiar flower. Let's just stick with our normal strategy. Doing this, throwing this down there, blowing up all that stuff. Okay. Hopefully, because I found those, people aren't going to just walk through that. We'll see. Man, this place is kind of deep. Maybe this is all part of the witches or Ethel's. The gods are watching me. Guys, be smart. Okay, good. Yeah, they didn't. They good. They walked through it. But yeah, I'm I'm very okay. Okay, that didn't hurt me too bad. I am very cautious about using my my powers. Okay, there's something else here. Somebody get it. Okay, good. Trap. Somebody saw it. Anything else over here? No. Let's just keep going down, I guess. Because I I feel like the more I use it, the more. What is that? That glowy thing. There's a cage here. Interesting. The more I use it, the more I'm giving my control, I feel like, over to the the tadpole. Which, you know, very well, it could be like uh like we're special and so we're not we are gonna get some sort of powers, but it's we're not gonna turn into a a gake, as Lazel calls it, those little mind flares. What's over here? Is that anything? No, nothing. Moving ahead. Oh. Step carefully. There's a trap. Okay, there's a trap. We'll be fine. We wanted the easy path. As far as everybody just walks past it. To press ahead. Can I rock up here? Ow! Keep freaking walking through traps. Is that another door? That is another door. What in the world? Can I get over here? Darn it. Okay, well I know Lazel. I'm pretty sure can. Yeah, she can get over here. Wonder why he can't. What the heck? What the heck is this? Mushroom circle? What in the world is this? Okay, this says it's the path to Moonrise Towers. I, I wow, I was not expecting to see this, let alone another weird, creepy door thing. Tov, can you? Okay, whatever. Tov just going to be forever over here uh all right let me we'll turn into a cat so that we can jump up there all right kitty let's let's uh get up here 
Wait, why can't I? Oh, I'm, I'm encumbered because I'm a freaking cat and I've got all this stuff on me. How much stuff can I carry? Okay, there we go. Now can I jump? Yes, okay. Are you serious, game? I'm a cat. Why can't I? Is it because I'm still super heavy? Jump distance is halved. Oh my gosh. This is just so much fun. I love doing this. <laughs> now can I get up there? Still too high. Are you kidding me? Why? Why does Tav just suck? Like, why can't I get up there? How can everyone else get up there, but Tav can't? All right, I've got one other option. If I will let me turn into a badger and go underground, hopefully. Okay, come over here, badgie. Bro, let's get over here. There we go. All right. So, there we go. All right, well, now that we're all together, let's not lead with him because I'm a badger. Skull. I assume if I step into that, it's going to teleport me somewhere. And I don't know if I want to do that just Detected. yet. Because there's a there's more stuff down there. But I did just come all this way Proceeding. getting Tov, so let's let's do it. Let's go ahead and see what happens. Where am I? Oh, it's dark. Okay, yeah, I'm in the underdark now. Oh man. Badger? I can see a little bit. Not very much, though. How much farther can I go? Oh man! Another step can I go forward. through? Where, where? Okay, yeah, that was an illusory door. Mushroom circle. There's another circle. So those are like teleporting things. Like, look how dark this is. Does anybody have? Uh, I crave blood. Starion. No time to I don't think who has the best vision. I don't. I think it would be Tav or Starion. Where does this one lead? Okay, it's down. Dead drow. I I don't want to. I don't want to be down here. Have to keep going. So this is this is how we know how to get to the underdark. Let's go back because I'm not ready for that just yet. Let's drop a quick save just in case we run into Auntie Ethel and she's not too happy to see us. I wouldn't be if I was her. Is there traps down here? Go slow. Ancient Adobe. Marina is down here. Wait a minute. That's the. Is that that girl's sister? In the cage. Don't do this. Is that the girl's sister? I think it is. Totally forgot about her. Is what's her face even down here? Where is uh? She's saying don't do this. Who's she talking to? Or is she just screaming because Objective noted. that's what her... <sighs> okay, who is better? What? What? Uh-oh. Oh, gosh. You'll come to my home, interfere in my business, and now have the gall to face me in the heart of my lair. You petulant bollocks. I'll rip your spine out your asshole! I'll use your blood to spice my stew! I'll keep you alive until I've sucked the marrow from your bones! And then I'll bring you back and do it all over again! Just get out of here! Please! Well, we found Auntie Ethel! How tough is she? Mm, 112 health. Why is she wanting us to stop? 112 health. Ooh. Okay, so it's Shadow Heart's turn. Probably the best thing I can do is bless everybody. So that's what I'm going to do. Okay. I need to spread everybody out too. Like, if she just casts something and just kills everybody, you know, that would not be good. So yeah. And I honestly, I think I am going to. Probably use my illithid powers, cause uh... Uh oh. 
No! Don't you... Don't kill her, please! Okay, she's gonna destroy that cage. Wait, did she just split into... Oh, great. Hag's trickery. Uh, is this... Yeah, okay, so it's an illusion. Oh, that's great. Uh, how can I save you? Tell me how to save you! Uh, yeah, what do I do? She can clearly jump down! Okay, get me out. Uh, okay, I'm going to have to think about this. What is the best way I can get her out? I am fury. I am death. I don't have any teleportation scrolls that I know of. Invisibility, feather fall. Honestly, in her her case, I don't think it's the fall that's going to kill her. She's falling into like water that is has a fairly strong current. It looks like. So yeah, it's probably going to be drowning that's going to kill her. I could blind her, and then she wouldn't see the danger coming. Okay, yeah. Shadowheart does not have any good spells. Does Tav have any good spells? Okay, hold on. So this is burning. So every turn for five turns, it's going to take 1d4 fire damage. So it'll take a max... Wait, sorry, hold on. Five turns? What did it say? Five turns. So it'll take a max of 20 hit points. So it'll still have health. Unless they are just constantly attacking it every single turn. Control orb. That's probably what I have to get to, to be honest. I wonder if I can interact with it. If I come here. Okay. I can get a little bit closer to it, but not... Not enough. <clears throat> I wonder if I could Misty Step with... Who has Misty Step? I think, um... Lazel does. He has so many things. I need to just start using actions and then... And this, because... Their bar is getting so long. Okay, you do have Misty Step, right? Don't you have Misty Step? Yeah, you do. But I can't... Yeah, it's not within range. I can't Misty Step close enough, unfortunately. Although I can get here. Let's, co let's come here. Do I have enough? Yeah, let's run over here. Okay. Get out of there, please! I guess she's she's gonna get a turn, yeah, so after one of these guys' turns, hopefully she can start running. Okay. So there. Alright. I don't know, man. I'm fighting I'm fighting four of the Auntie Ethels? I thought it was just three. Oh my gosh. I don't know if I'm ready for this, man. <laughs> these she is maybe a little too powerful for me. All right, who who still can go? Astarian, I think, can still go. Exploding arrow to deal 1d8 plus three piercing creatures and objects caught in the blast or potentially pushed, pushed back five meters. So I might be able to push her off of this. Let's try that, 65%. Oh, hold on, hold on. Let's, right. Oh no, maybe it won't push her back enough. Let's just try it though. And I missed. <laughs> Good job, Astarion. The guy that's supposed to be great at things did not do a good job. Well, so much for peace. I don't have any actions. Okay, well. Get out of there, Mayrina. Okay, good. She's she's out. Summon an illusion to distract your enemies. You and your allies receive advantage on attack rolls against a creature if both the attacker and the illusion are within three meters of it. That's pretty good. I might try that. Halt is not going to be useful. I mean, it it, it kind of is useful if, but it only it only lasts one turn. Was level two? They both last one turn, so it's. Wait, was it illusion? Invoke duplicity. Yeah, let's try this. Can I cast it like there? Yeah, there we go. Okay, so now, 
With Tav and Astarion, if I can get them in there, they'll have advantage. Can I heal Lazelle or is she too far? She's No no I can get I can get her. Yeah, this is You're supposed to be going for that thing! Stupid okay, what happened to Lazelle and Tav? What are they in? Is through. Poisoned. Is that what I'm no, I'm like shackled or something. That is Oh no, that's a Starion. Sorry. You can do this. A Starion. A Starion. Is he has hold person. Great. So I can't do anything with him. Wait, can I do anything with him? No, I don't think I can. Yeah, maybe I'm not supposed to do this. <laughs> or maybe I just get the heck out of here. Like Oh my gosh, man. She is Unless I just happen to pick the right one to go for. What is this? Aberrant shape. I would turn into a devourer and I can deal physic damage or sorry, psychic damage. Is that I don't know if that's All right, you know what? I'm going to I'm going to use moonbeam. Well, let's just try moonbeam. Okay. So that's one down. That is one illusion down. Okay, so they just have to take some damage. Okay. Oh my gosh, man. Yeah, and uh, th I think that's all I can do. That one can. That one's gonna dash. Good critical miss. Good. Okay, you're done. Hopefully, right? You're done. Okay, Shadow Heart's turn. So if I can just do damage to them, to the the images, then they will go away. Mm, do I have a better chance with my bow? No. Alright, fine. Guiding Bolt, level 1. Okay, that was a fake one as well. Alright. Come on, keep coming, Shadowheart. Get over here. Um, gosh, man, I wish I could... Ugh, hold person sucks, man. Oh my gosh. That sucks. Who should I... He can I heal anyone? Okay, I can heal Tav a little bit. Give him a little bit of health. Okay, my, my turn's done. Oh, great! Now Lazella's freaking hold person. Okay. You... You... Suck, Anti-Ethel. Like... Alright, do I have a... I'm, I've got to have a spell of hold person. And if I do, I'm going to use it, because it's it, it, apparently it's like overpowered. Old person. It lasts for ten turns. What's the what's the check? It's a wisdom save. Uh can I see how much wisdom she has? She probably has a oh 14. Okay, that's not as much as I thought. It is a, it is wisdom. It says wisdom. Paralyzing human creature, making it unable to move. At the end of each turn, the creature can try to free itself. Let's try it. Let's try it. Cast spell. Target must be... Are you kidding me? Why can't I just... Oh my gosh, that... That sucks. That really sucks. I need to find the other... Okay, hold on. You know what I can do? I can do... Moonbeam on you. Are you real or fake? You are fake. Okay, so this is the real Auntie Ethel. Uh, but two of my characters... Oh, oh no, you're free because she... Okay, good. That was, that was a genius move on my part. Totally did that on purpose. I think I'm going to make this episode a little bit longer just because... I think we're getting close. Well, I haven't done any damage to her at all. But hopefully... Potion of Giant Strength... You know what? Let's do it. Now I've got a ton of strength. Should be able to hit a lot harder with my weapon. But I can't do it now, so... Yeah, just get out of here, Marina. Or 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 just do nothing. That works too. Alright. With Shadowheart. What can I do? I want to get rid of... I want to... Can I blind her? Let's try Guiding Bolt level 2. Okay, that was pretty good. That was a good hit. Good job, Shadowheart. Okay, anybody need health? 
Tov kind of does, but he's fine. Oh my gosh, quit! <sighs> so one of these is the real Mayrina. There's only two of them, though. Oh my gosh, why? Why? Oh wait, I'm a genius. This one has guiding bolts, so that's the real one. <laughs> Get a nice try, hag. Yeah. I had you had the guiding bolt debuff, so I knew you were the right one. <laughs> ha ha! Take that, you stupid Auntie Ethel. You're not as smart as you think you are. I mean, you're still pretty smart. I wish I would have done more damage, but um, oh, I've only got one more level two spell. I'm gonna save it for Moonbeam again if I if I need it, but I will cast a level one spell healing on myself. Get a little bit of healing. Cut and run. Starion, you need to get some revenge. Nice. That was okay. Um, do I want you to be close to her? No, because Moonbeam would hurt you a lot. Swift and lethal. Okay, you're not going to be able to do anything. 35%. That sucks. Oh my gosh. Yeah, lays out fine. Yeah, when I have Moonbeam, I can't really do anything with her. Uh, I'm gonna save her spells. Charm, Disguise Self, Guidance. Let's try... Is this a level two? Yeah, it's a level two. No, I'm gonna... I'm just gonna use her for healing. Did terrible damage. Alright, what are you gonna do now, Auntie Ethel? Okay, that was not too bad. Move Moonbeam back right on top of you. I'm sure you like having the sunlight. Okay, did that even poison anybody? I don't really think it did. Did it get a star on? Nope, he's fine. <laughs> it's kind of funny. All right, take the shot, a star on. You missed, darn. Yeah, you are totally worthless right now. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. No, you won't. Come on, seriously, you're, you're, you'll, you barely will go anywhere. Let's just try it. Let's see what happens. Yeah, that didn't happen. She, nothing. And she gets to stand up on the same turn? What the heck? I wanted to pull her off. Like, what the heck, game? Come on. All right, she hit. Okay. Wait, how are you, how are you doing? Okay, you're, you have full health. So, that's somebody. Auntie Ethel's almost at 50%. I wish Marina would just, like, get out of here. Okay, you're in poison. Yeah, so let's get you out. Yeah, you're fine, though. 25%? Why is it so disadvantaged on attack rolls? Let's, let's use scrolls, then. Fine. If you're gonna be a jerk, fine, I'll use scrolls on you if I have something good. I could blind you, enfeeble you. Uh, yeah, let's try to blind you. A blinding creature can try to shake off the effect at the end of their turn. 50%. Blinded by the light. Oh, did you, are you blinded? Yes. Oh, good. She's blind. Okay. I mean, she's, she can still do stuff. Let's see what she's going to do. Oh, stupid. You keep duplicating yourself. Would you quit? 55... Go for you. No, no. Okay, I missed. Dang it. I don't know if that one's the real one. Can't even catch my breath. I really want to move Moonbeam on the right one. Okay, which one would does one of them have any different? No, they all do not have different. Well, this is the only one I can I can move it to. So you, you're the winner. And you're the fake one. You're one of the fake ones, so that sucks. You come up here, and I jump. Yeah, you jump over here. Let's get you here. And take a 45% chance. Oh, somebody's got to connect. Okay, Marina, just get out of here. Please. Yeah, I want something... Something that needs to... 
hit a lot of people. Wow, she has so many, so many things. And I have a scroll thingy. That's good. Does she have any bombs or something? Potion of sleep. What's the, uh... What? Oh my gosh. I thought that was something I would throw. Not, no, that was so dumb. She's gonna cast hold person on freaking everybody. Oh my gosh. Can I move this? All right, fine. You're the next, you're the next winner. Okay, nope, you're a fake. Sucks. Shoot, freaking Shadowheart. Oh, that was so stupid. That was not her fault, that was my fault. I thought- find a way forward. I thought that was something like, oh, I wanna- I wanna throw this. No, right not- now. Oh, that didn't have what I wanted to do. This is not going well. This is not going well. Please hit her. Okay, so the one way over there is the real one. But, at this point, I'm almost dead. And Shadowheart's asleep! And now he's got a whole person on her. Him. Good, you went in moon Moonbeam. Oh, and you... Okay, what? That was weird. Uh, okay, Lazelle. Hey, finally, you can actually do something. Please hit her. Can you help her up? Is there a help action? Is that a bonus? No, it's not. I cannot believe I... Ugh, that was so stupid! How long does that last? Three turns? Removed by taking damage or when helped. Okay, so I can help, but I just have to wait because I can't do it as a bonus action, apparently. Oh, you know what? Action surge. There we go. I could hit her again or I could help. I'm gonna help. Where's this? Where's the help action? There we go. She might get an attack of opportunity. Okay, good. She did not. Oh. That was so stupid. I thought that was something I was gonna throw. Oh man. All right, Shadowheart. Let's um. What else does she have? She's she's getting low. I'm gonna throw everything I have at her. Come on, guiding bolt. Oh nice, critical hit. Please don't do your stupid duplicity crap thing. Okay. No, okay, okay, that's fine. Astarion's fine. He's fine. Let's just move Moonbeam right on top of you. Right there. Please kill you. How are you so not, how are you not dead? All right, fine. Okay, I can't, all right, no, I can, uh, all right, let's just heal Astarion. Let's get him back up. Astarion's turns. Can you get the shot, Astarion, buddy old pa Oh no, you don't have any actions. Yeah, you don't have any actions. Um, but how about you heal yourself? There. That'll do something. Alright, looks like Lazelle's gonna get the- Yeah, 91% chance. Finish her off. Heck yes. You bastard! You ruined it! You ruined everything! You're welcome. Uh, yeah, I'm sorry, I was trying to help. But making everything worse? Ethel was going to bring my husband back. Back from the dead. And now I'll never see him again. Because of you. Uh, I hate to tell you, but she was not going to bring... Yeah, don't be naive, yeah. Honestly. Yeah, what did you promise her? Because she... And she was not going to bring your husband back, I'm sorry. But what did you promise her? This. Just a bit longer and my child oh, wow. would have been born. And all this, all this would have been over. Well, it's over now. You're welcome. You're going to trade your baby for your dead husband. That is stupid. Yeah, and with hags, nothing is ever over, to be honest. This was the best chance I had. For me, I'm my baby. Nope. Auntie Ethel promised to give this child a good life. Teach them magic even. You were so naive and stupid. More than I could have done. Oh, you're so dumb. Is that what Ethel told you? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Pick a terrible mother. <laughs> oh man. Yeah. I don't want to be super rude to her. She's in a lot of pain. Is that what Ethel told you? She said I'd make a bad mother. I... I think she was right. 
You would be a better mother now than I Ethel. Have to drag Connor's coffin all the way home. It's the only way this child will ever meet their father. I hope you're happy. I am. Thanks. I'm so glad she's concerned for my well-being. <laughs> Thanks, Marina. You're the best. Okay, so I did do that. Yeah, someone told me to find their... Yeah, here we go. Search for the lair for a way to help Marina. We saved her, but she was in a bad way. She left to say goodbye to her husband. Perhaps we can help her somehow? Wait. Oh, yeah. Let me... Let, let, actually... Can I... Oh, wait. Hold on a sec. Let's loot her. Wait, Marina. Please don't go yet. Oh, my gosh. She has a lot of stuff. But we'll go through this next time. Guys, thank you for watching. I'll see you all in the next episode.